This is the game Triple H. You're watching Muscle in the Morning. Get all your bodybuilding news and all your facts and stuff right here. <laughs> it's all about the game. And how you play it. All about the drone. If you can take it. Welcome back to Muscle in the Morning, brought to you by Iron Mag Labs. I'm your host, Pete the Producer, and I'm here to bring you all the latest news in the world of bodybuilding and fitness. It's November 25th, 2013, and on today's show, Kevin Jordan takes the 2013 Nationals. Breakdown of this past weekend's show. Plus, stay tuned for the answer to yesterday's trivia question, only on Muscle in the Morning. Heavy favorite and Team GAD athlete Kevin Jordan shows up in Florida and did not disappoint his fans as he took the overall this past weekend at Nationals. Coming in a little bit tighter and making the heavyweight class, this seemed to have been the winning formula for Kevin as he showed up in his best shape, beating out the massive Brad Rowe in the process. Congrats to new IFBB pro Kevin Jordan. In addition to Kevin, in the super heavyweight class, Ryan Pederecki comes in massive and edges out second place finisher Joel Thomas. In light heavies, the very symmetrical and structurally dominant Chris Tuttle takes the win over second place finisher Lorenzo Jones. In the middleweight class, Thomas Anderson shows us his genetics and full muscle bellies that put him in first over a very muscular Danny Hester. Moving down to the welterweight class, the shredded and vascular Eddie Foster dominates the class in convincing fashion. In lightweights, Damian Ricketts takes his class. And finally in bantamweights, David Nguyen grabs a pro card as well. Stay tuned for tomorrow as we discuss the other divisions. Now for the answer to Friday's trivia question. The question was, at age 17 and 18, what other competitive sport did Andreas Kohling excel in during his time living in Japan? And the answer, freestyle wrestling. Now for today's trivia question. Known as a pump trainer, what piece of weightlifting equipment did Surgeon Bray use for each workout regardless of what body part he was training? Don't forget to tune in tomorrow for the answer. And that does it for another edition of Muscle in the Morning, brought to you by Iron Mag Labs. I'm your host, Pete the Producer. See you tomorrow. And make sure to follow us on Twitter and Facebook.